We are always trying to provide you with the most updated information on what's taking place downtown Fayetteville with the stadium build. But this time we wanted to do something a little bit different. We wanted to speak with some of the people who work behind the scenes and some of the things that are done before construction even starts. So come join me, let's go find out what's going on. Hello, my name is Patrick Hayes. I'm a project engineer for Bart Mallow Company. Specifically for the project here in Fayetteville, I am leading the BIM effort building information modeling. Um, coordinating all the different work that the trades do, plumbing, electrical, mechanical, steel, concrete, and make sure that everything lines up appropriately, that everything is getting built per the plans and the specs. And I can show you a little example of that. All right, this is the basic 3D view of the Fayetteville Minor League Baseball Stadium. But if you'd like, we can take a deeper dive. We can go into some things that you may not see, which is the underground piping. This is all the mechanical plumbing, fire protection piping that goes under the stadium. We can take a look at the front entrance. Dive into the team store. I can coordinate things like different lights, lighting fixtures, mechanical pipe. And what I do is I can coordinate different plumbing items hitting steel beams. I can show whether a plumbing pipe needs to go up, down, move to the left or the right, make sure all the mechanical duct is aligned properly. Before the project starts, we do a lot of plan reviews, scope reviews, coordination before we actually break ground. And during the project, we make sure that everything is being built per the plans and the specs. Before using 3D technology, we use 2D technology. So we would basically take the plans and drawings, different sheets, we would overlay them on top of each other, and you would get a sheet similar to this. And from this, I could go by the elevations delineated on the plans to can to coordinate whether something needs to move up, down, make sure everything spit, fits in the space accordingly. I got interested in construction through uh, various amount of programs that I came up going, going through school. For example, I was in Rockamy, which is Regional Council for the Advancement of Minorities in Engineering. Um, I also was a part of different clubs at North Carolina a State University, and they provided me with the knowledge and plenty of opportunity to get into contact with companies such as Bartomello. 